Hello guys, how y'all doing today? This review is about old Craftsman power tools. I had a request for this. Uh, I did the one with the hand tools not too long ago. If you haven't seen that, take a uh, look at that. It came out pretty good. Uh, I have a lot of interest in that. So here, these tools are all bought in the early 80s. This is the reciprocating saw. And this was the industrial line, which was the top, the, their top line. These tools were over $100 uh, 40 years ago. They all still work, guys. And I don't use it as much anymore. I obviously have cordless tools, but that's one of the first ones I bought. Electric impact. Half inch. Bought that probably 81 maybe, and it didn't have a lot of power, but that was that's the best. Those were that's as good as it got back then, <laughs> you know. And uh, like I said, it's part of the industri the industrial line, and that was their top line. That's heavy. Four and a half inch disc grinder. I was using this up until oh I don't know. Maybe five years ago when I started buying a cordless tools. It still works pretty good. The industrial line, which was top line back then. A basic three inch drill. That's the first power tool I bought. I was like, I was so proud of that when I bought that. I was only a kid, you know? And I use it for mixing paint now, that's about it. The industrial craftsman's jigsaw. Uh, this, this, I think it needs a new cord, guys. That one's pretty well <laughs> beat up. It had the adjustable blade where it kicked out or it kicked out. The little levers right there. That was pretty cool. Uh, I don't like I said. I use mostly cordless now, but this was all part of the industrial line, which was that was their top line back then. The half inch drill with the auto chuck. I didn't I didn't care for that auto chuck, but hey this this tool this had some this had some snot. You know, it's all part of the industrial line back then. This was probably 150 bucks 40 years ago. I don't use it much now. Like I said, I use mostly mostly cordless. And last but not least, in this video is the one horsepower drill press. Cast, that's all, cast, that, that thing is heavy. I bet you that weighs 150 pounds, guys. And it has the uh, five inch chuck. The 15 inch table, cast table. 12 speed, one horsepower. One horsepower <clears throat> electric motor. You can see it back there, that's a good size motor. It's got, you know, this thing is, it's got original belts, guys. Let me turn, it's got a light on it, too, by the way. I don't know if you can see it, see how it lights up. She still works. Hey, guys, if you haven't subscribed, think about subscribing. The channel is starting to grow, and I really appreciate everybody that has subscribed so far. I love your comments, I love your feedback, and I always try to get everybody, get back to everybody as soon as possible. Uh, the channels, we're going to keep going forward. I got a lot of good stuff coming up. Um, and stay tuned because I do a lot of tools and I'm going to be doing a lot of, a lot of other stuff in the shop. But, you know, like I said, I got so many cars in here now. I can't move around, you know. There's a ranger over there. I guess that's the green one. That's my little, my little monster. <laughs> All right, guys, that's it for today. If you enjoyed the video, uh, give me a thumbs up. If you want to leave a comment and, uh, I'd love to hear back from you guys. Okay. That's it for today, guys. All right.